previously on Outlast. With only seven remaining players, everyone was looking to the end of the game. In a challenge that once again came down to Will and Lydia, Will's memory proved better and he won his third individual immunity. Back at camp, Lydia used the clue that she received to find a hidden immunity totem, with only Jake Chuddy knowing about it. At Tribal, Chuddy's physical prowess made him a clear target, and the whole tribe, including his ally Lydia, aligned to vote him out, making him the third member of the jury. Tonight, at Final Six, is the last chance players will have to use their hidden immunity totems, and both Ben and Lydia have one of their own. Only six remain. Who will be voted out tonight? All right. Final six. You've got another immunity challenge today for a chance to win that necklace and guarantee yourself a spot in the final five. Are we awake? Rise and shine? Yeah. Yeah. Because as you can see behind me, we've got a fun challenge. Uh, first things first, Will, I'll need to take that back. Immunity is back up for grabs. For today's challenge, each of you will start at the top of a slip and slide with a number of rings on it. You'll slide down and grab one of your rings. When you reach the bottom, toss your ring onto the pegs. Once you land it, you'll run back to the top and do it again until you've rung all three rings. First to do that wins immunity and is safe at Tribal tonight, guaranteeing them a one in five chance of being the winner of Outlast. Worth playing for? Yeah. All right, let's do it. And remember, our juries here, Tess, Jack, and Jake Chuddy voted out at Last Tribal to observe. Survivors ready? Go! And they'll race down the slide, gotta pick up their ring. Will's got his pink one, Jake's got his yellow one. Everyone else moving more slowly. Chloe's got a purple, Jenna's got a teal. Ben bringing up the rear, and now they've gotta land a ring on the peg. Everybody taking shots. It's a might be a long challenge. This is a tough shot. Everybody missing so far. No one really close. Ben comes up short. Will lands his first ring. Will's got one, everybody else is still swinging their first. Lydia's just off. Two. Will's got two now, pacing this challenge. No one else with any rings, Will with two, sliding down for his third. Chloe just off the peg. Still anyone's challenge here, this could be a long time to land that ring. Will's looking to seal it here. Just off the top. Lydia with the shot. Lydia gets her first ring. Jenna lands her first ring. Will still looking to close it. Just off. Jake is long. Ben's long. Lydia's got her second ring. Jenna's got her second ring. Putin just off. Will in and out on that one. Jenna's long. Putin gets his first ring. Will lands his third ring, wins immunity, a guaranteed one in five shot at winning out last. Will, for the third time, individual immunity, come get it. Will, once again, immune tonight at Tribal. Cannot vote for him. Everyone else is fair game. Uh, you guys can head on back to camp. I'll see you at Tribal in a few minutes. Ice cold water and dish soap. Yeah, I guess we're clean now. In a way. Last challenge is a bit rough to start the morning, but I guess it woke us up. Uh, I think Will is just the, the most accurate with the ring tossing at this point, and even though some of us got a couple, we really weren't gonna catch up to him. I think our alliance is really, really strong at this point. I think our biggest goal right now is just one of us three win each challenge, that way we can have all the power in the voting. My plan is to go to the final three with Will and Jenna. I would say I'd be a little bit worried on the, the challenge aspect with Will, 
but I'm really not sure how he's done with the social aspect and I know that I've laid low a little bit more than he has in that uh, sense and that might come to my advantage if people feel like they got backstabbed by him at some point. The last person we went out, and they went to the chat Yeah. Right, sir? Huh? That's what you're talking about. If it came down to one of us not getting it. Which would you know? Yeah. Okay. Ben. Okay. Oh, yeah. And they're gonna be free for me. Maybe I can figure out who they're with. Yeah. Because I feel like Jenna will be with them. Maybe. I think I'll talk to Jenna. Okay. Well, then we'll have on the boat for ever since she's been with us and we can get Ben to vote too because he doesn't want to go home so we're like tag with us and you won't go home tonight so we've been able to get honestly like everyone but that person that we're trying to get out on our side but yeah she's gone <laughs> see ya yeah she's a threat she did well in the challenges yesterday and we feel like if she made it to the final three she would have a really good case like I don't know why she wouldn't win I mean she's survived every single tribal council she knows she's on yeah. the chopping block, so, she, so she's she's trying to get somebody to turn to her side. So she knows she can't get me. I think she wants to be gone, but that's That's Jack wanted you gone too. <laughs> Sorry guys. Chances of the hidden eye being found over the other campfire. We're not ever over there. I know, but the girls were like, what? I don't think they were. They didn't see. They didn't see the clue. And they were the And you found the clue in the apples. Yeah. It was a long time after, and this was the last time we could use it. But like, what if one of them? Yeah. Jenna. Jenna. Are they doing that? Yeah. I'm not doing anything. Are you playing the idol? I think that would be smart. That's like a guaranteed spot. Mm -hmm. oh. And told everybody that we're voting out Jenna for so many Oh, yes. Okay. Absolutely. Okay. Just it's not sure. really a I think it's a secret. I yeah. think she's probably. She's not she's really scared because like. she's talking to you guys. Yeah. She's and trying she to get people to do that. Mm -hmm. I just hope Ben doesn't get. Even... Well, he's he's going to be safe. Well. Ben's safe. Yeah. Ben's using his idol tonight, so yeah. nobody's gonna look for him. We'll now welcome in our jury. Tess, Jack, and Jake Chuddy voted out at the last tribal council. Here to observe. All right, final six. Big tribal council tonight where you're deciding who the final five in this game will be, who the people that have a one in five shot to win Outlast will be. Will, third individual immunity in the merged phase. Uh, how does it feel having that necklace around your neck tonight? Uh, a lot of security, and that's a good feeling to have at this stage in the game. Are you optimistic about your path going forward, having won some immunities, um, having been in an alliance that's really directing what's going on so far. I'm somewhat optimistic, but there's still a lot of question marks and there's still a lot of things that could go wrong or change, so never know. Jenna, it's no secret that the three of you, Will, Hooten, and yourself, been together the whole game, have been working closely together. How important is that group in what's happening tonight and going forward? Honestly, since the first hour we're here, it's been so important. I mean, you almost have to have an alliance to get things done in this game. So it's been really nice to have someone, some people that you can trust and that are on the same page with you the whole time. 
Chloe, you've worked with that group, but does it make you feel a little nervous being with a group where you're not one of the core members? Yeah, a little bit, um, definitely. Um, it just depends on, like, if we do get to the final four, that means that someone will have to do backstabbing for me to be able to get into the final three. So just navigating that and knowing when to make your move. So we all know that final six, this tribal, is the last time that hidden immunity totems are in effect. This is your last opportunity to play one of those totems. Ben, you have made it completely clear that you've had one of those totems from the first hour of this game. Are you wielding that tonight? Uh, yeah, I feel a lot safer because that guarantees me immunity and a spot on the top five. If you want to, you can pull it out right now. So Ben's made it clear, you can't vote for him. Will's made it clear with that necklace, can't vote for him. Hooten, that limits your options uh, with fewer people in this game to choose from. How is that affecting this vote? I'd say probably the alliances are playing a big part right now in this stage of the game. Yeah, Lydia, what's going in to how you're voting tonight in order to keep your streak going of survival? Honestly, I'm not sure right now, but I feel pretty confident and it does make me a little nervous because I know at the beginning I was close with those three from the Blue Tribe, but you can see pretty clearly that I'm on the outside and we'll see. Jenna, is tonight's vote going to be a cut and dry one? Is someone going to be surprised or is this going to be an easy vote where everyone's on the same page? I think it's kind of in the middle. I think for the Alliance, for us, it is cut and dry and we knew pretty quick, but I don't know if the person thinks that way as well. Ben, do you think someone's going to be surprised tonight? Um, I think so. Um, I think that the alliances are pretty strong. Will, you've got your individual immunity today. Uh, are you going to hold on to that, or are you going to give that to someone else? I'll keep it. Very good. All right, it's time to vote. Lydia, you're up. You played a heck of a game, Lydia. Just, just one question. But sorry. I'll go get the votes. If anyone has a hidden immunity totem and would like to play it, now would be the time to do so. Ben? This is a hidden immunity totem. All votes cast for Ben will not count. Hey, Alex, can I use mine? Come on. This is a hidden immunity totem. All votes for Lydia will not count. Anyone else? I'll read the votes. First vote, Lydia does not count. Lydia does not count. Lydia does not count. Lydia does not count. Fifth vote. Lydia does not count. No votes are tallied. One vote left. Next person voted out and next member of our jury, Jenna. You need to bring me your torch. Jenna, your tribe has spoken. Time for you to go. Just looking at your faces, I don't think that was what you expected tonight. No. When I asked if the person going home would be surprised, I think what you all had in mind was the wrong person who would be surprised. Time to head back to camp. Probably the craziest tribal council so far, um, but we were all planning to get Lydia out because she's a threat and kind of out of nowhere she pulled out her 
hidden immunity idol and so then literally whoever she wanted out was gonna be out and that was me. I sure hope <laughs> Lydia doesn't win after that. <laughs> I like it's definitely I found my element. This is totally something that I would love to do again. I say shout out to Will and Jake, you guys were were awesome and I'm totally rooting for you to hopefully one of you guys wins the game.